Alright guys, in this episode, I tell you why we are rolling on the paint. And now, we're going to spray paint too. Rattle can't and roll it. So untraditional. <laughs> Okay guys, there it is, the Volkswagen behind me. Why are we rolling the paint? Why not? Simple as that, why not? We're proving the internet, we're gonna break the internet showing that you can do a $50 paint job. It'll probably work out more like 85 bucks after spray cans now. And a handle. And some more tape. And undercoat. But hey, it's a cheap, economically friendly paint job that will look way better than it was and if all else fails we can always sand it down and take it to a place but where we live it's literally in the middle of nowhere um, the closest paint shop is at least two hours away and to go get one of the good old Amco $500 paint jobs or whatever they do I don't know however much it is now it's like four and a half hours away so that's not going to happen uh, once we get this car to Kentucky that might be a possibility but so far with the roller we got this crazy super high dense foam roller and with the hardener and the you know metal let's see oil based glossy awesomeness it's turning out pretty good we sanded down the first coat it's pretty easy to sand Still leaves a nice hard shell. Knock it down so we can paint it again. What you guys have seen is just uh, test run and trial and first coat stuff. So definitely more to come on the rolling. So right now let's spray paint. <laughs> Rattle can it guys. This is going to be professional. Like I said, we never said we knew what we were doing. We just said we're having fun. And we're going to give it a try and learn what we're doing. So that's what we're going to do. I want to work on the ivory. i um, been working more on the fenders. Got another fender back there. Primer drying. Bondoing. Seeing what else we missed. With some sandable spray primer. Got another one in the back here. Done. And then in that corner right there. There's another one that has heavy bondo work needed to be done. Because it's so wrinkly. So, if you want to be awesome, send us some new fenders, great. If not, we're using these fenders, however they turn out. So, the roller and the rolling technique is hiding our imperfections and our unprofessionalism of bodywork, since we both have never done it. <laughs> and so, we're just giving it a whirl. We've got to start somewhere, so we're learning how it works and what is working and what is not working. And for overall, I feel like we're pretty successful so far. Some of you may comment otherwise, but we're getting it done. So uh, here we go. More to come. Let's get some more stuff going on this Volkswagen.
All right, guys, there you have it. Untraditional spray painting with a can. So hopefully next episode, I can finish sanding the hood and another fender, how to do more work too. Hopefully get it all smoothed out, sanded, primered. So the next episode, we can hopefully get the painting again. So get another can, a quart of the blue paint and add the hardener, get it all ready. And then work on putting the second coat and the first coat for the fender and hood and trunk. So things are happening, progress is happening. Hopefully you're liking these episodes. Make sure you like and subscribe if you like what you just see. And follow along with this build. There's definitely more to come. We got the new parts finally showed up. Headliner finally showed up in the mail and the front window. So we can work on taking that broken thing out and then uh, get the headliner installed. Finish getting the interior paint touched up. Headliner installed. Painting of the car. Then we can do windows, seals, gaskets. Then we can do the interior panels and carpet and all the fun stuff. So, taking some time, but things are looking good. I'm liking the ivory on the side. It'd be awesome with the blue. You kind of get an idea right there what it's going to be looking like. Blue fenders, blue hood, blue top, ivory center. So, it's going to be awesome. Again, thanks for tuning in to this episode of Wide Open Throttle. There's definitely more to come. Uh, more progress on the Volkswagen and some of those other projects that I post on the channel. Till next time.